Hello everyone, and welcome to this new video. Today, I'll be sharing some valuable tips and tricks to improve ADS aim accuracy in Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale. Improving ADS aim down sight accuracy in Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale requires a combination of settings, adjustments, and practice. Here are 10 settings you can tweak to enhance your ADS accuracy. Number 1. Sync ADS FOV. In Call of Duty Mobile, ADS stands for aim down sight, FOV stands for field of view while aiming down sights. It refers to the width of your field of vision when you're aiming through your weapon's sights, as opposed to the wider field of view you have when not aiming down sights. The difference between turning it on or off would depend on your personal preferences and play style. Sync ADS FOV on. When this option is enabled, the game will try to maintain a consistent field of view. When you aim down sights, this means that your perspective will zoom in slightly when you ADS, and it will maintain a similar FOV to what you have when not aiming down sights. This can make it easier to track and engage targets because there is less of a sudden change in your view. Sync ADS FOV off. With this option, disabled, your field of view will change more drastically when you aim down sights. It will zoom in, more making targets appear larger but potentially making it harder to track fast-moving targets or be aware of your surroundings. Some players prefer this mode for the added precision in aiming. If you're a phone player, it's better to have it off because when enemies are far away, you can't see them very well due to the screen size of a phone. However, if you're an iPad player, it is definitely an advantage for you. Number 2. Adjust Sensitivity Settings Sensitivity Settings Control How fast your aim moves when you swipe your screen. Lower sensitivity settings make your crosshair move more slowly, which can help you aim more precisely. Start with a sensitivity setting that feels comfortable and gradually adjust it to find the right balance between speed and accuracy. Number 3. ADS Sensitivity ADS Sensitivity is specifically for aiming down sights. It allows you to fine-tune how fast your crosshair moves when you're scoped in. Lowering this sensitivity makes it easier to make small adjustments for accurate shots while ADS. Number 4. Scope Sensitivity Scope Sensitivity lets you adjust how fast your crosshair moves when using different scopes. Lower values are typically better for scopes because they reduce the chances of over-aiming when zoomed in, making it easier to track and hit targets. Number 5. Fire and ADS Button Placement Adjust the size and placement of your fire and ADS button to make it comfortable and easily accessible. This helps ensure you can fire accurately when needed. In Call of Duty Mobile, you typically have two main ways to use ADS button. Tap to ADS and tap and hold to ADS. Tap to ADS. In this mode, you tap a designated button or area of the screen to instantly aim down the sights of your weapon. It's a quick way to aim, but you need to keep tapping to stay aimed. Tap and hold to ADS. With this mode enabled, you tap and hold the designated button or area of the screen to aim down the sights. Releasing the button or lifting your finger returns your view to the default hip fire mode. Experiment with both tap to ADS and tap and hold to ADS options to see which one feels more comfortable and effective for your aiming style. Number 6. Aim Assist. Aim Assist is a feature that subtly helps you track and stay on target when aiming. It's particularly useful when you're close to an enemy but need to make minor adjustments to your aim. Enabling this setting can significantly improve your accuracy. Number 7. Crosshair Placement Crosshair Placement is a crucial aspect of gameplay. 
In Call of Duty, Mobile Battle Royale, it involves keeping your crosshair, the center of your screen where your bullets will hit, at head level and aimed at the most likely spot where you expect enemies to appear. Always keep your crosshair at head level as headshots deal. Significantly more damage than body shots. This means you should adjust your crosshair placement based on the terrain and elevation changes. If you're moving from a higher ground to lower ground, lower your crosshair accordingly. Number eight, graphics settings. Adjusting graphics settings is essential for optimizing performance. Higher frame rates can make your aiming smoother and more responsive. Lowering graphics settings can improve performance on lower end devices. Number nine, gyroscope sensitivity. Gyroscope aiming uses your device's built-in gyroscope to assist with aiming. Adjusting gyroscope sensitivity controls how responsive this feature is. It can be a helpful tool for fine-tuning your aim, but it requires practice to master. Number 10. Lean and Prone Use the lean and prone mechanics to your advantage during battles. Leaning and going prone can make you a smaller target and make it harder for enemies to hit you while aiming accurately at them. Remember that improving your aim is a gradual process and it's essential to find settings and techniques that feel comfortable for you. Consistent practice and applying these tips will lead to significant improvements in your ADS accuracy in Call of Duty Mobile Battle Royale. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing. Your support means a lot to me.